Hey guys, it's Abby and today I am back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my Ipsy, I don't know what it is. To be honest, I didn't get the Ipsy icon box because girl, guys, I don't, girls, guys, <laughs> I haven't recorded in a really long time, as if you can't tell. Um, it is so hot in my house. My air conditioning doesn't work. It is like 80 something degrees outside, but the humidity is absolutely ridiculous and I'm sweating. So I have a cold <laughs> beauty blender right here. So I can just, so I can just mop up the sweat as I film. Okay. So Ipsy, I didn't get the iPod, the icon box because they ran out of boxes after they told me they shipped mine. So I didn't get that. So I got another box and it, it's huge. It's got like a ton of stuff in it. Now I know I got some stuff for my points because they gave me a ton of stuff. They gave me a ton of points. No, oh, that's a lie. They gave me like $3,200. Nope. I wish. I wish. Give me that money. Um, 3,200 points. And I got a bunch of stuff. So I'm assuming that this is what holds my points and my Ipsy Plus or is it BoxyCharm by Ipsy? Ipsy by BoxyCharm? One of those names. So let's just open it and see. So when you open it, it looks like this and ready, set, play is the theme. Um, they don't give you anything on the inside and get to know your boxy charm picks. Okay. So this is a boxy charm and this is going to annoy me. This thing right here. Let's, is that better? This shirt is from Amazon and it's a Henley shirt. I love these. I have them in like so many different colors because they're so comfortable and I'm, I'm like obsessed with them. I wear them to work because at work it's freezing cold at work because the air conditioning is always so cold and everyone's always so hot there. So they put the air on really low. So I have this on and a sweatshirt on when I'm at work, but at my house I shouldn't be wearing it because it is God awful hot. Okay. How about we do my bag first? Oh no, there's only one thing in here. Oh shit. There's only one thing in here. Let's do this last. Let's see what is actually a full size in here. How many go come in here? Five? You guys are like, Abby, get it together. I know, I know, I am. Okay. Tresluce, maybe the Tresluce. I don't know, I'm gonna show you all the full size products and we'll decide at the end or you guys can decide what's in the box. Okay, so the first thing is the Rose incorporated and this is a micellar makeup remover and it looks like this and I oh you see my nails I went to a wedding last time I actually made a video I told you guys I was going to a wedding it was so much fun I'll put some pictures actually there's pictures on my community post it was so much fun I got all dressed up I got my nails done they need to be filled um but I'm going for red next time because I I'm typing on a computer during the day at my job. So I'm like, and I kicked ass at work um, this week. I really did. I, and within a half hour, like the phones were going crazy. And then within just a half hour, I was taking routine consults. I was so proud of myself. I was talking to nurses, taking down all the information. I did so awesome. I didn't mess up, nothing. I was really, I'm just proud of myself because it's hard learning new stuff, especially medical terms. It's just really hard, but I did it and I'm, very proud of myself. Okay. Anyway, here is the micellar water and you just pump up here, which I don't really like these because I feel like you're going to see me. Being like, um, I feel like these, they're just harder to use rather than just something you just go like this with, but I'll use it. I will use it. Okay. The next thing is this, this is the beauty bakery lemon bar face palette. looks like this and two bronzers and a highlight right here I don't use highlight that much anymore um, just because it's like a step I forget but there it is we'll do it again like that there you go okay and then there's the bronzers I'm not gonna swatch those yet because they're bronzers so got those um, I have a pair of lashes which these are really pretty these might actually be a point I think I remember picking up points oh wait I did I got two of them they're the same ones these are by Violet Voss and they are in the style just slaying so let's see what they look like I am obsessed with the kish the kish 
Kiss Lashes. They are the, I forgot what they're called. They're like light green and they are in the style Noblesse. I'll show them to you in just a minute. I love them. They're like my favorite lashes ever right now. They're, so here are these lashes. They're pretty. They're a little spiky. They're a little full. They're a little flared. I do like these. Um, these are the lashes I'm wearing right now by Kiss. You guys, I love them so much because they flare at the end. And they're just pretty. They're not too much, but they're not... They're not too much, but they're not too simple that people think they're your actual lashes. Like when I wear lashes, I want to look prettier. Does that make sense? When you wear lashes... That's why you're wearing them, because I swear, lashes do make your makeup look better. Um, but I don't want them to be too big, because I have a small face. Okay. Not like, I do, I have like small eyes, nose, and mouth. Um, not my actual face size. Okay, so I got those lashes, so that's not a product. Okay, so then I have uh, Il Maquillage Color Boss Squad. We used to get these a lot from Ipsy. Um, I don't know if these, this is like a newer palette or if it's an older one. I don't know, but let's see. Does anyone else get your nails done and then you can't like do anything? I literally can't do anything with my nails on at all. They're the worst. They're the worst, but I love them because I can, but I literally can't do anything else. I feel like I don't know how to like button buttons, pick up a quarter off the ground. It's, it's just a mess. Here are the shades. These are really pretty. I like them a lot. Um, a basic palette for a basic kind of gal, which is me. Uh, the shimmers are beautiful. Very, very pretty. So the, there are the shades really pretty. I'll definitely use these. I do wish there was maybe like another matte rather than three shimmers, but I'll totally use it. Um, okay. We have a Tres Luce Empower Me Matte Bullet Lipstick. And it's in the shade Nudie Pink. Let's see. Here is the packaging. And here is the shade. I think that's really pretty. Oh yeah, that's like a, be that's beautiful. Really, really beautiful. What? Oh, it's a bruise. Sorry guys, I have a bruise here and my, my hands are a mess. I was literally in the hospital last week. I'm all bruised up from it. Don't ask. Okay, and we have this and this is a Lip Shine Lip Balm. I should have gone into my account, but I didn't. I apologize. Right here. And this is just a lip balm, which I will, I will use this for work because I don't really put anything on my lips at work, but this is by, this the shade is XO and this is by um, Misho. So I'm excited to have that. I can't have enough lip balms or lip glosses right now. And then I have these, these are two lip liners. I believe I think I picked these if I'm remembering correctly. And we have Lucky Chick. These are, oh, they're Lucky Chick Lip Liners, and they are the shades Lucky Passion and Lucky Dreams. So let's swatch. Ooh, I like that one a lot. That one's beautiful. It's actually perfect for this lip color. Oh, so is this one. So there are the two shades right here. They're perfect together, aren't they? Perfect, okay. Did I say perfect enough? They're perfect, they're perfect. Aren't they perfect? Okay, so two lip liners. Okay, I think those are my full size products. So whatever came in my box, I'm not mad at at all. Um, I'm actually really happy about this. Then I have this bag right here. Let's see what this is. Refreshments, it's a vibe candle. I wonder if this is one of my full size products. I don't know, but here is the candle. I don't know. Did you ever get like a, a bath bomb from like the drugstore and they all have that like kind of like powdery lemon scent to them? That's what this smells like. So I'm not like super excited about the scent, but I love having candles, so I'm not mad. Okay, and the last three things that are in here, I believe these are, for, nope, four things. I believe these are for my points. 
This is the Glow Recipe Guava Vitamin C Bright Eye Gel Cream right here. And I'm very excited to use this. I love anything for your eyes. And then I have two of these right here. These are the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue. They're natural matte tinted moisturizer with broad spectrum SPF 30. So I picked Vanilla 2 and Natural Pecan because I didn't know what. I have a really hard time picking shades for anything online. So I just decided I would get two shades and if one's too dark or one's too light, I can mix these together and make the perfect shade. So here they are. And I'm very excited to use these because I don't like using um, full coverage foundation, especially to work because I have to get ready super early in the morning right now. My, my schedule is going to change. It will be, I'll be going to work at three, but um, I am going to, I go to work at eight now. So in the morning, so in the morning, I'm like trying to drink coffee and wake up and just doing a full face makeup just isn't going to happen for me. So I think this would be really good just to even out the skin tone and not feel too heavy, especially in the summer as well. Okay. And the last but not least is this, and this is the self smooth 10% glycolic resurf resurfacing serum right here. And it says 97% 97% saw a clinical reduction in pore size after 24 hours. So I'm excited to see if this actually improves your skin texture. It's very small, but enough to try. Um, okay, so that is my Ipsy Glam Bag. No, my Ipsy, my BoxyCharm by Ipsy. Um, I thought whatever, was, whatever I got was not bad. I'm going to use everything because um, I think that it was all pretty good. I, I got basically a full face of makeup. I got lashes. Um, the tinted moisturizer, which I picked for my points, um, eyeshadow, bronzer, highlighter, uh, lipsticks, lip liner. Like I got it all except the only thing I'm missing is blush and I've got 7,400 of those in my makeup. So, um, I'm not mad at not getting one. So I thought it was really good. I wanted to show you guys, um, I wanted to show you guys the new skincare that I'm using right now because I'm very excited to try it. I actually heard people saying that it was um, Botox in a bottle and I started doing a bunch, started watching a bunch of reviews because I was like, yes, I need Botox in a bottle, Botox in a bottle um, just to put on your face. So I am going to show you what I purchased. It was very inexpensive and I'm very excited to try it. Okay, so the first thing is this. This is the Ordinary Glucoside Foaming Cleanser. It's gentle and it foams right here. I got this because I wanted to try some of their skincare and I was like, might as well just get like almost a whole skincare routine through it. So, um, I got this, this is $12 and 50 cents. Not bad at all. It's pretty big. And I used it this morning. I like it. It didn't leave my face squeaky clean, which is good because when you, when your face is left squeaky clean like that, it's like basically sucking everything out of all the moisture out of your skin. Like you need some moisture in there. I have been using this. This is the drunk elephant pep. Drunk Elephant Proteiny Power Peptide Resurfacing Serum. It's 10% lactic acid and has 11 signal peptides. I love this so much. This is going to be a repurchase for me because it's $80, um, but I got this in an Ipsy and I've been using it. I use it every week and this has made my skin so smooth and it looks so good. So I love this so much. If you guys are looking for a product that will, ow. If you're looking for a product that like just makes your skin smooth and takes away texture, this is really good. I swear by it. It has changed. It has changed my entire face, like the skin on my face. I love this so much. Okay. And these two right here. So these are by the ordinary. These are like nine bucks. This is the, the Argyra line solution, 10%. It targets the appearance of dynamic facial lines right here. And then this one is the matrixol 10 percent ha high strength peptide formulation and you're if you 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 can use these each by themselves they each target different areas but they basically do the same thing from what i have heard in reviews they help with the fine lines on your forehead if you have one right here like a fine line right here because i go like this a lot and it stays like this for a while um i don't wake up with it but throughout the day as i'm squinting or if i'm i'm a very expressive person and you can see that line between my eyes. I don't want to get Botox, but I don't want to have a line there forever. You know what I mean? And I have some 
smile lines right here. Definitely they're showing more now than they ever have. And I, um, whenever I put foundation on, I can see that I can see the lines even more, which I'm 42, I'm 42 years old and I'm starting to get these little lines here. So I wanted something that's going to help me with fine lines. And after the reviews, I've watched a bunch of them on these two products and they say, if you use these together, they are, they're like a double whammy for your face. They're gentle, yet they completely help with all those lines and stuff like that. And from what I hear, like, it's like Botox in a bottle where like, even when you go like this, you don't see the lines as much. Or if you make that like line right here, like when you do that, it helps decrease that. So I'm going to use these. I'm going to use them till they're all gone. They're all gone. And I will let you guys know um, what I think about it. If this is a review that you guys are interested in, please let me know because um, I will definitely let you guys know if these work or if I like them, if I've seen a huge difference, if I haven't seen a difference, I'll let you know. I'm going to be using these with this and then I have moisturizers that I put on top. I don't have an ordinary moisturizer, but their moisturizer was stupid expensive for the price of these. Does that make sense? Like their moisturizer was really expensive, but the these aren't. And I was like, well, I have like 5,000 moisturizers, so I might as well just use what I have and use these. So I'll let you guys, if you guys want to review, let me know. I'm really excited to try these and see what happens with my fine lines. Um, and if it's truly Botox in a bottle. So let me know. Okay. All right, guys, that is it for this video. I've missed you guys. I hope you guys are doing really well. If you guys are interested in a catch up video, let me know that as well. If you guys want me to just do an update. I am willing to do that and that is it for today guys. I hope you guys are doing really good. Thanks for being here. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.